Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's Dusty's girl here. Uh, let's see, it's Keto Vimba Day 14 and it's about 8.48 and I'm up, yeah. So actually today I am heading out to go to an elementary school and read to a third grade. It's National Educations Week and the parent that was supposed to read the book backed out so I'm going to step up and do it. So yeah, so as you can see I have on my good vibe shirt because we're going to be sitting, I'm sitting myself good vibes because I hope I ain't got to check none of these kids. Yep, so I'm going to go head on. I'm going to get me some coffee going, warm me up some breakfast, and I'm going to be out the door. So, see you soon. Hey everyone, so I am in my car. It's 40 degrees out here and it's windy. It's cold as crap. But the sun is shining, so no complaints here. As you can see, I'm being graced and blessed with those good old natural vitamin D sun rays. Look at this. Black skin need the sun. I love it. So anyways, I am letting my kitty mobile warm up before I pull off and then yeah. I'm on my way to go read. Lord, please don't let me get trumped up on my words in front of these kids. Because after all, I am a grad student. So I should, and technically on paper, I am able to read. So we'll see how it goes. See you soon. And every day, the boy would come. And he would gather her leaves and make them into Stop. crowns and play king of the forest. And he would climb up her trunk and say in swinging from her branches and eat apples. So this tree got a lot going on. He can climb up the tree, he can swing on her branches. And what does she, what is she offering him that's very nutritious? Apples, good job. And they would play hide and go seek. And when he was tired, he would sleep in her shade. And look, he ate two apples already. It's full. And the boy, he loved the tree. Very much. And the tree was happy. But time went by. And the boy grew older. And the tree was often alone. Then one day, the boy came to the tree, and the tree said, Come, boy, come and climb up my trunk, and swing from my branches, and eat apples, and play in my shade, and be happy. And the boy replied, I am too big to climb and play. I want to buy things and have fun. I want some money. Can you give me some money? I'm sorry, said the tree, but I have no money. I have only leaves and apples. Take my apples, boy, and sell them in the city. Then you will have money. In Can anybody tell me what the moral... 
So this has turned out to be an interesting evening. So I just spent the last, um, what, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, the last five hours at the library doing homework. And on my way home, my car cut off. So I am stuck. It will not cut on. Like the car, it cuts on, but then it cuts right back off. It's crazy because the radio is still working. I think the heat is still working, but I haven't tried to like turn it on. So, yeah. So now I'm just sitting here waiting on roadside assistance to come and give me a tow and to take the car to the shop. And I'm keeping my fingers crossed, guys. And I'm hoping it is just a serpentine belt that popped, which is an easy fix and it's not expensive and I'm just praying that it's nothing major because the kitty mobile is paid for and I am not in like a financial status where I can get a new car so I don't want a new car because I don't want payments and yeah so like and I don't want to blow my savings on trying to purchase another car either so let's all say a prayer for the kitty mobile I'm gonna give a moment of silence and I just have this one thing to say to the kitty mobile, get your shit together. Cause I take good care of you. So yeah. So it's about 420, I'm sorry, 412 now. And the guy from the tow um, company said they wouldn't be long. So hopefully they aren't. And then, yeah, I'm in the house. I had plans on going to Pilates tonight, but that's not going to happen. So I guess I will maybe do like a, um, like a hip hop aerobics dance something tonight in the house just to get my exercise in and yeah so <sighs> what a day all right so i guess i will see you guys in a few Okay guys, so I finally made it home. It's 6.30. It has been an adventurous afternoon. Um, yeah, so the guy's gonna check my car out in the morning and then he's gonna call me and let me know what's wrong with it. And hopefully guys, it doesn't break the bank to fix the car. So it is what it is. I stopped and I'm just, yeah, I don't even know. So I just stopped at the store and I got some lake trout and I'm just gonna eat a few pieces of that lake trout and call it a night. And apparently while I wasn't home, my niece took Dusty outside guys and he fell down the steps and hurt his back leg. So it's been a night. Like I'm just, I just wanna go to sleep, sleep it off, let the universe work this stuff out and then try again tomorrow. So yeah, I'm gonna go head on and I'm gonna sign off early and just try to get my mind right and keep a watch on Dusty, y'all. So, pray for this old man because he always hurting himself now. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Ciao.